fun. Little people roar in the face of fright. It was time for the big backyard show. The band announced the stars of the show, Eddie and Sophie, but just as they were about to come out on the stage, they heard Maya yelling, my cat, my cat stuck up in a tree. Have no heck fear, said Eddie. Super Eddie is here. Eddie burst on stage wearing his cape. You have to save Mr. Pawpaw, cried Maya. Don't worry, said Eddie. Super Eddie is always heck ready. But as Eddie got closer to Mr. Pawpaw, he realized something wasn't right. Wait a second, heck, is this cat a toy? Shh, said Maya. He doesn't know he's a toy. I guess there's no case too big, heck, or too small for heck, Super Eddie. Sounds like Super Eddie has a case of the super hiccups, Sophie said, and there's only one Kurt cure. We have to scare them away. Nothing scares Super Eddie, he replied. I've got an idea, said Sophie. Let's turn our junk. Jungle Safari into a Jungle Scare Fair. Go ahead, Sophie, but you'll never scare these hiccups away. S Sophie, Eddie, and Maya, Tessa, and Colby jumped out on stage, and suddenly they were in the jungle. You really think so? You really think this will scare away Eddie's hiccups? asked Colby. I just need a little help from Sophie started when a loud group of monkeys burst out. They jumped down from a tree in front of Eddie, shrieking and waving their arms. Oh, oh, hiccup me. Eddie joined in with the silly monkeys. They hadn't scared away his hiccups. Sophie, Maya, and Colby crouched behind a bush. This will definitely scare Eddie, Sophie said to her friends. Eddie, she called out, want to play hide and seek? Sure, I'll count. Eddie replied. One hick, two hick, three, and elephant suck, snuck out the, from the bushes. Four hick, five hick, the elephant kept closer to Eddie as he counted. Brrrr, the elephant trumpeted loudly in Eddie's ear. Eddie went flying into the air. Ah, yelled Eddie but he still wasn't scared. Super Eddie can't hick fly. Let's do it again, he said as he ran back to the elephant. I've got one more idea to scare Eddie, said Sophie. Will you help us scare Super Eddie, Leonard? Sophie asked. I eat superheroes for breakfast, replied Leonard. Leonard snuck up behind Eddie, getting closer and closer. Finally, Leonard was right behind Eddie. He let out a huge roar. Roar, Eddie replied. He wasn't scared at all. Every, everyone's scared of something, said Leonard, but not, heck me, said Eddie. Suddenly, the sky turned dark. It started to rain as clouds rolled in. Boom, there was a huge clap of thunder. Ah, scared screamed Eddie as he ran into a cave. The others chased Eddie into the cave. Did, did something scare you? Sophie asked Eddie. Uh, no, said Eddie. Boom, there was another thunderclap. Yikes, said Eddie. I'll admit it, I'm scared of storms. It's okay to be scared, said Sophie. Everyone's scared of something. Then Leonard the lion said, when the sky roars at me, I just roar back. Eddie slowly came out from the cave. Okay, Thunder, take this. Roar. Hi, everyone, said Colby. Eddie's hiccups are gone. We scared them away.